I was very bored and I have class at 12.30. It's like 12 o'clock right now. And I didn't want to go looking like a drowned sewer rat. <laughs> so I filmed a little get ready with me. It's like basically just me ranting about makeup and other people doing makeup. And I know I'm not a professional. Like, Sis, if you get mad at me for saying something that you do. Shut up. And I'm just going to get the hell on with the video because this is boring. So see y'all later. What's up, f***ers? Um, today we are doing a makeup look. <coughs> um, I don't really know what it's going to be. I think it's going to be an everyday thing, but you never know, man. You just never know, bro. Bruh, look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the... <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Lorac Light Source. This is like a test rig at Ulta. I don't know where it's from, but whatever. And do it right here on the areas where I want to put my highlight. And then take this old janky beauty blender that I only use for moisturizer and primer. Just blend it in. Okay. So now foundation. I use the Tarte Amazonian clay because I used to have bad acne. I'll try to insert a picture, but <laughs> sis. Um I got this in my Ipsy bag, so I might throw in a pump of this, even though it's not my color. Um, and then I'm just going to mix it with my brush. I probably won't even end up using as much foundation because Shishtar does not use a lot unless she's going to go like hoe out or something. But I have class at 12.30? Yeah. So, I'm just gonna dot it on my face. Um, uh, I'm sorry for like this weird ass light. That's just very up living in a dorm, you know. And I know I don't use my beauty blender right. Don't fucking drag me for it. And you also can't see my nose ring because I have a retainer in. Because when I work, they won't like me to have my piercings out. It kind of blows ass, but whatever. Drag it down the neck. And like, it doesn't stick to like under my eyes because I have these little fat pieces right here. It's the joys of being me. And then for concealer, as Laura Lee would say, we're going to whip out this old ass CoverGirl concealer that I had when I was still dating my ex, which is... A fat ass while ago because the sister is single and I don't really do it in any certain shape I just go ham because my face is fucking red all the time <laughs> we're gonna do a little excuse me some on the nose and some <laughs> And if you do your eye makeup, before you do your face makeup, you're a f***ing lunatic. I don't care. I hate people that are like, Oh, you do your foundation before you do your... Before you do your makeup? I'm like, yes, I do. Because I want to. The f I'm going to be casting a lot, so I'm so sorry for editing me that has to censor this shit. Yeah, thanks a lot. Okay, now you got a good face going. It's not too harsh. Try to down our shush our neck. I look like a lunatic. Okay. Deceased. Okay, so now we're gonna take our Cody air spun. And I don't like the translucent shade. I have it in the honey beige. Because they also honey the translucent, but we're not gonna talk about that. Ew, there's a hair on it. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna get powder all over my shirt. You just go 
the sister ham. I'm not talking in this one at all. This video is going to be like 2.5 seconds because I can't speak and focus. And then we're going to bake our little under eyes. Just taking that same damp beauty blender and dipping it into the powder. Like, where's the fucking blow? Where the fucking blow at? <laughs> So now that you look all coked up, you're going to take a brush and you're going to make sure that it's not in the way of your eyeshadow because that would be tragic. Um, I just wipe it all off. <coughs> okay. Now, here's the thing. I've not done my eyebrows, nor have I attempted to do my eyebrows since I moved into college. And... I moved in in August and it's November, <laughs> but we don't care. We don't care in this family. So we're going to brush our eyebrows into the most decent shape they can get with my dry ass skin. And then we're going to sister fill them in. Yeah. So I like a super thick brow. So I'm going to. Fill that shit in. Oh, messed up. <laughs> we can carve that out later. It's whatever. So you're just gonna like keep getting it in the little corners. And don't fucking drag me saying like, oh, you don't think you're a cutie girl? Like, no, bitch. People ask me how I do my makeup, and I'm like, like, anytime I wear makeup around my mother, she, like, flips shit, and she's like, you're the new Jeffree Star! And I'm like, Mom, you're retarded, stop it. But, it's kind of cute, so I let her do it. Now, once you have done the best you can possibly do, you're just gonna take the little spoolie end and brush all that dry skin flake out of your eyebrows. I just realized how disgusting that is and how I should not have talked about my flaky eyebrows. Because you're disgusting and you hate touching your face. Like, I used to have acne. And let me tell you, it was bad. And I was always super scared because my doctor told me, like, don't touch your face, you'll get acne. And I'm like, fuck, all right. Guess I won't touch it. But now I feel like it's okay for me to touch my face since I am on medication that helps me not get acne anymore. But you know, I'm still a sister scarred, so people next door probably think I'm like doing crack. It's fine. Because they don't know. They don't know the YouTuber grind. <laughs> oh yes, dead skin flake off. Mm. And one thing that people have problems with my eyebrows is like they're like, you don't do the tail. You don't like actually try to make it look good i'm like i do though like i'm just lazy i'm a college kid do you think i really give a flying fladoodle what my eyebrows look like no take one of these boys i take the foundation off of my heck in hand oh these things are the most powerful shits in the universe like i uh I used one and I set it down on my countertop and I put like a little like eyeshadow on top of it and it melted the plastic. Yeah, melted. So, it's Glamouflage Concealer. Like my mom bought this when she worked in a swimsuit place and they wouldn't let you have tattoos visible. Like that's how strong this shit is. And I take this little, oh, I could clean this up. this little concealer brush that I got in my ipsy bag and I just dip it in there nothing sister special oh and I'm also going to do a little dab of my foundation because that's how I carve the top of my brows because if I use this shade then I would look a crackhead but when do I not so then I'm going to get all up in my eyebrows business and carve it out I'm sorry, I have to focus really hard because I have caveman eyebrows, so I'm sorry if you're not getting enough instruction as you wanted. So now that we are snatched, we are going to 
try to blend it out a little bit. I don't know. I mean, I'm just doing my best, man. So then I like, I draw a little line and then I see if it's even with my other eyebrow because making my eyebrows even is a daily struggle. Cause this one little Chinese lady, she did my eyebrows before prom and they looked super good. But then when they started growing out, I was like, what is wrong with my face? Like she like, she big messed up. And then I went to get them done again after prom with my best friend. And she's like, oh, sweetie, who messed up your eyebrows? And I was like, my eyebrows are messed up. She's like, yeah, one's like higher than the other. I was like, um, I don't touch my eyebrows. So that must have been the little Chinese lady before prom. And what made me mad is like that little Chinese lady was complimenting me the entire time. Like she was like, oh my God, your eyebrows are so pretty. You have beautiful eyes. And I was like, thank you. Oh my God, you're so sweet. And then she fucks up my eyebrows. Like, how are you gonna do me like that, sis? And then, yeah, it was just a shitty time. But my makeup looks so good for prom, like, all the people I talked to at prom were like, Oh my god, who did your makeup? And I was like, I did. And they're like, shooketh. I don't know why they were shooketh. So I used to have this, um, this feeling that I could not go out into the world without having foundation on. So I used to wear this orange ass foundation every day to school. And I'm pretty sure that everyone at my high school hated me for it because it made me look like one of those um hershey's cookies and cream bars but let's not talk about that um and yeah like i just look disgusting all the time so i'm taking my foundation and i'm just gonna go up the sides of my brow and then do a little like little outline and this gives me time to like even out the top because I like them very square see this is where I usually jack up and make them look super ugly for no reason but you know it's like everything's harder on this eye like I can do this eye really well I can put lashes on this eye really well I can do wing liner on this eye really well but anything else is just like actual trash like I'm literally like pulling foundation out of my freaking eyebrow. Focus, fuck. Okay, we can see it kind of there. Because <sighs> this part, if it doesn't look blended, it will stick to my dry skin on my forehead and like make me look like an idiot. And you're not trying to look like an idiot when you're sitting in class next to a really cute boy that wears a Travis Scott t-shirt every day and you just want to marry him because that's your husband too. Do I even have my blending brush? So now that our brows are snatched, we are going to set our eyebrow. So, I have my Jaclyn Hill palette. Yes, ma'am. And we are going to take... I'm not going to do shade names because I'm too lazy for that. Plus, I don't want to be like... Eh, eh, I'm like looking at the, the shades. So, I'm going to take an orangey transition shade. And just pop that in. Plus, I keep my mouth open when I do my makeup. I feel like I shouldn't do that. And my friend came to see me at work, and she's like, "She wants to spend the night tonight." And I was like, "Yo, that sounds fun. Like, we haven't had a sleepover since like junior year." She's like, "Yeah, like it'll be fun." Blah, blah, blah. And I was like, "Okay, bet. Like, I'm down." And I thought we were gonna hang out, and she just gets to the house. And she's like, "I'm tired," because she like worked the next day. So I lay down on her bed or on her couch and something flew into my mouth I don't know what it was I don't know who it was I don't know why he felt the need to fly in my mouth but I choked for a solid 45 minutes trying to get this bug or whatever it was out of my throat and I could feel it like I could feel it crawling up my throat and it was absolutely disgusting so I'm going to take this darker brown and kind of set it in my crease so it looks like a more like kind of sunsetty eye. I don't know. I'm on crack. Um, just keep blending the shit. 
now it's starting to look good. So now that I've done a shitty blend of this, I'm going to highlight my brow bone and I'm disgusting. Watch how I do it. I go. Take the most pigmented shade and throw it on my brow bone. If you put shimmers all over your lid and like in your crease, you're the worst type of person ever. I don't care. So I'm kind of liking where this is. I'm not trying to really impress anybody. We're going to take our bake off. I dropped my bronzer. So this is all I have is this little, the balm fudge. So I'm going to dip into Thomas. And it says anti-orange, but it still makes me look orange, which is cool, I guess. Just carve out those cheekbones, sis. You can barely see it, but you know, I'd rather be a blended sister. So I have the Moonchild palette, and I only use one color, which is Pink Heart, and it's almost gone, so. Just sister swirl it, and putting it on my nose, my Cupid's bow, my cheekbones. I work all freaking break, which is great. I work every day except for Thursday. Look at So I'm gonna take my Tarte Feisty brush because, brush, blush because I broke my other one and I usually don't use this shade because I don't like super dark shades but God I'm so itchy this is why I hate putting on makeup that's disgusting ew I don't even curl my eyelashes with mascara on ugh whatever story time my friend's stepmom ripped out her eyelashes using one of these in the car uh oh I think it's funny how I only got into makeup like four years ago. Oh my god, I can't speak! I'm gonna keep doing whatever I'm doing. And I used better than sex because everything is better than sex when it comes to men. Men are trash and you should never have sex. Boys are gross. They don't care about your feelings. They don't care about what you want to do. They care about them self. You can quote me on that. I don't care. It's not bad, but it's not great either. It's just mediocre to say the least. Um, so, I don't want to do lips because liquid lipstick makes me want to hang myself and jump off of a bridge. I'm just going to dig for my baby lips and hope I can find it. Yes, ma'am. I love lip strokes. Um, I got some on my mouth. I wish this was the Jeffree Star lip scrub so I could eat it, but it's not. <laughs> oh, I hate the way this shit tastes. I love how soft it makes my lips. But the way it tastes is horrid. So, after you've done your scrubbing, just put on your favorite lip gloss and you're done with your natural daily look. So, if you want to leave a comment, you can. Um, I don't get any comments on my videos because oh, I only have my channel for... Mm, two weeks. 
but my first video was like a really trash vlog and my ex-boyfriend was like you should use this this software this 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 that and i'm like how many youtube videos have you made don't come for me uh, that is pretty much it Ew, i'm picking like the skin off my fingers if you want to subscribe, go ahead. Um, I'm not going to be posting a lot, a lot. Like, I'll try to post, like, maybe once a week, but that's, like, max. Um, yeah. Like this video. Comment. Subscribe. Send it to your friends. If your friends need to know the ins and outs of the shit that I don't do in makeup, send them this video. Copy the link. Send it to them. Check out my Instagram and my Snapchat, they will be all linked below, and I hope you'll have an awesome day.